hello guys welcome back to our channel so in today's video i am going to show you how to make a shooting game but first let's talk about the scratch okay this is our code area this is our code blocks this is our sprite and this is our stage and this is our sprite area so let's get started so first thing first we will delete this sprite and we will upload our backdrops don't worry, I will give you the links in the description. You can also use it for yourself. Let's delete this one and then go to code area. And now let's add our first sprite, which is our round log. Okay, let's put it in the desired location and it's a bit bigger. Let's decrease its size to 80. That's perfect. And now the code will be, it will stay right here when the flag has been clicked. Okay. So for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked let's zoom it out okay go to motion block we will use point in 90 direction after that go to control block we will use forever then go to motion block we will use some coordination after that it will go in the back side of the layer so for that go to looks block we will use go to back layer okay that's perfect and now for the background sound let's go to sound area we will upload our background sound okay let's go to code area let's put it in the code so when the flag has been clicked after that go to control block we will use forever and then go to sound block we will use the background sound let's see so now for the next step we will upload another sprite which is our scope so it is a bit bigger let's decrease its size to 50 that's better so the code will be wherever my mouse goes it will follow so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to looks block we will use go to front layer then go to control block we will use forever and then go to motion block we will use go to where where my mouse goes let's see that's good and now let's add our shooting hand okay let's put it right here it has another costume so for that go to costume layer and we will upload it's another part okay that's good now let's go to code area so the first code for the hand will be it will move in the left and right direction but not in up and down direction so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to looks block we will use same again go to front layer and then it will show okay after that it will change its costume it has two costumes okay so it will be the normal one after that go to control block we will use forever then go to motion block we will use this coordination but we will go to sensing block we will use mouse x so it will be lock right here let's see so now it is locked right here it will go left and right but not up and down so that's good so the second code will be whenever i click down so it will change its costume so for that go to events block when the flag has been clicked after that go to control block we will use forever then we will use if then or else after that go to sensing block we will use mouse down which is our click okay so whenever it click down it will change some costume so for that go to looks block says costume to shoot and then it will go to says costume to normal let's see that's good and now for the gunshot sound so for that go to sound area we will upload the gunshot sound okay then go to code area then go to events block when the flag has been clicked it should make a sound so for that go to control block use forever if then after that go to sensing block we will use mouse down which is our click down okay so whenever the mouse is down it will make a sound so for that go to sound block we will use gunshot sound after that we will add some weight so for that go to control block we will use like for example 0 0.3 seconds 
Let's see. That's good. So now it is working. And now we will need something that we can shoot. So for that, go to Upload Sprite. And we will add some glasses. Okay. Let's put one right here. So the code is simple. Wherever I shoot this glass, it will break into some shatters. So for that, go to Events block. When the flag has been clicked, after that, go to Looks block. We will use it, will show. After that, it will have. So it has a lot of costumes. So we will use the first one. Okay. So it's costume to one. After that, go to Control block. We will use Forever. And then we will use If Then. And now go to Sensing block. We will use Touching Color, which will be the color of our scope. After that, go to Control block again. We will use If Then again. And then go to Sensing block. We will use mouse down. So whenever we shoot the glass, it will change its costume. So for that, go to control block. We will use repeat block. So it has 12 costumes. So we will write 12. After that, go to looks block. We will use next costume. And now we will be needing some glass breaking sound. So for that, go to sound area. We will upload some sounds. Okay. Then go to code area. After that, go to sound block. We will use sort glass breaking sound. After that, it will hide. So for that, go to looks block and we will use hide. Let's see. That's great. Actually, this game is about timing. So we will be needing some countdown. So for that, go to gun hand sprite. And now let's make our own variable. Okay. Which is our time so idea of the game is you have limited time to shoot all the glasses so for that we will use go to events block when the flag has been clicked go to variables block we will use our own variable which is our time so let's add for example 15 time after that go to control block we will use repeat but 15 times and now let's add some weight so for that we will use wait one second after that, go to variables block again. It will change into change my time by minus one. So it will be like 15 seconds and the countdown started. And then go to looks block. We will use it will show. Okay. After that, go to motion block. We will use some coordination. Let's add zero and zero right here. So when the countdown is finished, it will be game over right here. So for that, let's add some costume, upload costume, our game over. It will be right here. So for that, go to code area and then we will use, go to looks block. We will use switch costume to game over. And after that, the game should stop. So for that, go to control block. We will use stop all. Let's see. <laughs> That's great. So now the time is working. So in the next step, we will add some score. So for that, go to events block. When the flag has been clicked, after that, go to variables block. We will make another variable, which is our score. Okay, that's great. And now we will use set my, which is our score, set to zero. After that, go to control block. We will use forever. After that, we will use if then, then go to operators block. We will use, like for example, we will have 8 glasses and then go to variables block. Again, we will use our score right here. So this code means there will be 8 glasses. So whenever we shoot all of them, there will be some costume like you win. So for that, go to looks block. We will use, so it will show. After that, go to motion block. We will use coordination, but in zero form. It will be in the center. After that, we will be needing the costume. So for that, we will upload our U-Win costume, which is this one. Okay, then go to code area. Then go to looks block. We will use sys costume to U-Win. After that, the game should stop. So for that, go to control block. We will use stop all. And now let's go to glass sprite. And then go to variables block. We will use 
change my variable which will be our score by one whenever we shoot the glass let's see that's good so now you can see it is plus one so the last step is we have to make some duplicates of our glasses and we can put wherever we want i will put it according to my desire you can also use it for your desire okay now let's put some of them right here you can put anywhere you want but i will put it right here let's change its direction okay that's good and now let's make another duplicate and then put it right here by changing its direction okay let's put it right here and we will make another last one okay let's change this direction towards the other one and now let's see the overall results actually i didn't expect it will work but it was an amazing game so if you like this kind of games let me know in the comment section and i will respond fast have a nice day and goodbye